The Dark Ones came much later. From the garden's direction. The Dark Ones. Huge. Towering a full head over the highest man. Nightmarish creatures. Creepy as a man turned inside out. Monsters born to destroy us. The word was they were incredibly strong and unnaturally evil. That with bare paws they could tear armed men apart. Joseph. That's all lies. Truth is even scarier. Well, I used to live nearby. Before the war, I mean, uh, up there. I was on the train when it happened. I tried calling my family, but couldn't get through. What the? What happened? Shit! 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 What's going on here? Incredible news. A couple of days ago, I was near the ruins of the Dark One's hive, and I saw one of them, still alive. I immediately set out to find you, as you were the one they tried to contact, before you launched the missile strike against them. Khan! How the hell did you get here? Get out! Now! Yes, Ullman, one moment. If a Dark One has survived, it is vital that you try to speak with it, Artyom. I realize that, as one of the Order now, you report to Miller. But we must persuade him to allow this mission. Khan, I told you to get out! This is a classified base, you shouldn't even be here. I'll take you to Colonel Miller. Follow me, Artyom. Get ready, Artyom. I'll be waiting at the exit. Move it, you windbag! I knew a smoker once. During the last year of his life, he had to eat, drink, and breathe through a tiny hole in his throat. We found this place a while ago, but they still can't get used to it. Strange place, this D6. I didn't know they were... Привет, Артём. Артём was one of the men who found D6. They gave him a ranger's badge on the spot. Yeah, that's nice for him. I had to spend two years as a cadet before they accepted me into the order. Well, anyway, where were we? The story is, construction started in Stalin's time and went on until the USSR broke down. War was inevitable, they said. And the people who lived in a better future. Our leaders put their money in Armageddon. You have five more sets of 30. <laughs> Look at those two rookies. Pathetic. Carry on. No wonder the colonel ordered training to double. Shots. 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 through the marshes to the church base. Keep your back straight. Romanov's the only one who makes it there alive. You're shitting me. The rest of the group wiped out? The marshes are easy. You just look for the markers and flags and walk along them so you don't drown. A child could do it. Well, okay, the shrimps always gave you hell. But come on, what could take a whole squad down? No idea. They found Romanovs alone at the church. 
sitting on the floor praying. Since then, he doesn't eat, doesn't react to people, he just speaks to God. <laughs> Hope Romanov's not expecting an answer. <laughs> Welcome to the armory. I hear you are a ranger now, huh? We must get a drink sometime to celebrate. For now, let's get you equipped. So, first things first. You're going to need a gas mask. You can't make a step on the surface without a gas mask. It's been 20 years and the radiation still strong enough in some places to boil water. There are hot spots down here in the metro, too. Don't forget filters for the mask. Sure, it looks cool enough even without these. But they definitely make it better for your health. Now med kits. Well, what can I say? Anything you need for survival in a stylish orange case. Here's your advanced salary for this month. Remember, your pay is in military grade rounds. Sure, you can use them as usual ammo for some hefty extra damage. But saving them to buy guns, attachments, regular ammo and equipment from merchants anywhere in the metro seems like a smarter move. All right, now to the good stuff, huh? Let's get you some guns. Take the ones you want and try them out on my range. Visit us soon. Check the doors. Lots of them are still sealed. Some are welded shut. And there's a few that look like they were locked from inside. So what? So there's radioactive shit behind some of those doors. Hot enough to bake an egg. Doors. Miller's calling the green as it. There's going to be a big assembly. Please, or some will be nice. So, you're an expert on hell and its denizens? At last, someone with a common interest. Pay no attention to this clown, Alex. Open the gates! Have you heard about Lisnitsky? What are you talking about? Check with the guards at the lab. Shh. What the hell did he do? All right, let's go. The tombs of ancient kings were filled with whatever they might need in the afterlife. Weapons, gold, chariots. They'd sacrifice their wives and slaves to serve their lords even in death. Reminds me of this banker. Cut that shit out! The things in D6 are like what the Conqueror took with him beyond the grave. Cold steel, 
and wild steeds and treasures untold. Of course, the Tomb Raiders would always die horribly, killed by demons or ghosts, or their own greed. Can't will you shut up or what? Okay, I heard that Lesnitsky did something. What happened? Nobody knows. Lesnitsky was at the lab. When the next shift came, the door was open and the lab ransacked. Lesnitsky was gone. Shit. So, what's inside? Chemical weapons, maybe some other shit. That's, that's all I heard. God damn it. The colonel's going to tear me a new one because of Lesnitsky. A red hot poker right into my soul. If I still had one. All right, let's go. We might control these seats, but it's like a damn city down here. All the bunkers, the nooks and crannies and exits. Still, I based the order dreamed of finding. Especially the ones close to the Nazis. Just let free. Two Nazi assault teams have started the fight with raids somewhere on the surface. Over what? And if I know, what are they doing on the surface in the first place? They never went there such numbers before. HQ thinks they're looking to break into this place. Well, you couldn't hide the news forever. And now they're all salivating over D6. Ah, seems like we'll have to share it. With hungry wolves? Miller ordered all our men assembled here on this base. And then Kruma, take these guys to Miller. They've been summoned. Yes, sir. All right, go on in. I'll wait here. When you've gone, I'll speak to Miller. The bombing of the Dark Ones may have been humanity's worst mistake. What if they meant us no harm, but were trying to communicate? Perhaps the severe pain and loss of consciousness suffered in their presence just meant we were incompatible. Machines with different wiring. But somehow you, Artyom, have the common wire. The connection with the Dark Ones. Yes. People died at exhibition. Your home station. Hunter, the best of the order, is most likely dead as well. And he taught you this. If we don't fight for our lives in this new world, we'll be devoured. It is the law of evolution. But, I would argue, the old laws no longer apply. All right, Artyom, and you, God, you have something to report? Yes, Colonel. Let's keep it short, then. I located the surviving Dark One at the gardens. What? One of those things is still alive? Luckily, yes. Luckily? Come, this is utter madness. The Dark Ones were the greatest threat the Order's ever faced. Colonel, just... Give me a chance. A single Dark One is no threat. Artyom has a gift. I believe he can establish contact with the creature. Let him come with me. All right. Artyom, go with Khan to the gardens and locate the Dark One. I'll send a sniper along. My best. Anna. Yes, sir. Why would we need a sniper? To eliminate the creature and finish the Order's job! Miller, you can't! It's murder! Restrain him! You idiot! You're making the same mistake that... We're done here. Escort Khan out of here. Artyom! It's your last chance for forgiveness! For getting rid of the nightmares! Ah. Forget about Khan. Looks like he got close. Too close to the creature and lost his mind. Look here, Artyom. Complete the mission and get back here quickly. A war is coming, and I'll need every ranger at his post. On your way. So, what are you waiting for? Come along, rabbit. Artyom, if it's true that the Dark Ones can sense you, maybe you could draw it out from hiding so Anna could have a clear shot. But do me a favor. Don't let the Dark One get into your mind, or Anna will have two targets. Is that understood? We now suspect Lesnitsky was a sleeper agent, 
but we haven't verified who's running him. Your job is to intercept him before he delivers the stolen container. Understood? Yes, sir. If Lesnitsky escapes with the container, the entire metro is at risk. So if you can't take him alive, you damn well better bring me his head. Yes, sir. Dismissed. Don't tell me you believe that bullshit about making peace with the Dark Ones. I wish I had been up in that tower myself to see the missiles fall and watch them burn in their nests. Come on, Rabbit. Would you let those things into the Metro? Let them crawl into our brains so they could use us like animals. Maybe we could mate with them so the children could live on the surface and feed off the radiation. Shit. You don't shake hands with the devil. Please step away from the edge of the platform. Train coming in. We've worn this place out. Let's move. Just a year ago, I stood on top of the TV tower and saw missiles rain on the botanical gardens, turning the flesh into ashes, smelting metal and glass. Nobody and nothing could survive that inferno. Yet Khan did find a Dark One there. Now my mission is to find and eliminate it. To finish what I started. In the past, trains were ordinary things. But now, this monorail seems magic, doesn't it? Our kids won't know how to operate these things. And their kids will probably think this was built by the gods. Alright, we've reached the station. This is part of the secret Metro 2 line. We haven't explored these tunnels. Can't spare the time or manpower. So don't wander off. on the system and get the lights on. Use your flashlights in the meantime. Right. You ready? Let's move. Watch yourself. The doors are closing. Good luck. Yeah. We need it. Didn't you and my father take the monorail when you went out to fire the missiles at the Dark One's nest? That's a good sign, Rabbit. Maybe we'll have luck with this mission, too. Power's working. Open the gate. I'll cover the passage. Great. You did fine after all. All clear. Move out. All right, the map shows a collector entry point ahead. Move, I'm following. Go right, there's a dead end on the left. Something alarmed him. Stay sharp. Things fast. I don't think we'll run into anything serious here. 
Great. The ladder. It's just a little more walking. Then we'll see if you're a rabbit or a man. Surface, put your mask on. With looking at my ass, it's way out of your reach, rabbit. Give me a hand here. Let's go to the main entrance. There's a good shooting position there. I can cover a lot of territory. You're supposed to be immune to there. What? Influence? Oh, I don't have your gift. So hop along, rabbit. Head on in and look for the creature. I'm thinking that since the Dark Ones are so fond of you, it'll sense you, or smell you, or whatever the fuck they do, and come from hiding. Just try to stay in the open so I can cover you. We'll maintain radio contact. And if you have second thoughts, don't worry. I'll do it. Okay then. Good luck.
fast. How did it do that? Circle it from the left. It's still there. Targeting. The creature I met in the burnt-out remains of the gardens looks like a dark one. And it was able to enter my mind, dragging the innermost out of me. But it was also just a baby. And I am sure that it recognized me. And got scared. It also left me knocked out for some time. Just enough for me to get captured. These prisoners were captured at the botanical gardens. Seems like they were looking for something. These two are red. They refuse to speak. The third one looks like a ranger of the order. A mutant the size of a child was caught near him. It was delivered to Reich as well. I'll deal with it later. This one. Suspected mutation. No, no, I'm normal. See, two arms, two legs, ten fingers. Don't you understand? I'm a Hatsa citizen. Shut up! You are not in Hansa. Here you are a suspect in the distribution of corrupted genes. And this is your trial. If your skull has the correct proportions, you are free to go. If not, you are an abomination. Science, you see. This is an outrage! I told you to stay still! Well, let's see. 318 millimeters by... 302. Let's look it up in the table. Ah, congratulations. You're a mutant. No, no, please! Do the garbage shoot. A simple question. What was your mission in the garbage? Go to hell yourself, Nazi. I'm gonna count to three. Bomb. Glory to the red line! Two. Long live covered Moskvin! Please! Please, I'll, I'll talk! I'll talk! But, but, but away from the other side, they'll kill me if they hear, okay? Take this one to the second unit. Usually, Reich does not interfere with the Order's business. But here, we have you, the Reds, and the Freak, all caught in the same net. I do not like it. So talk, or take a bullet to the brain. Get the officer! Hey, you! Uh -huh. Here, you keep the knife. Keep it. So, uh, 
Here with the Spartan Order? I'm from the Red Line. Uh, our superiors are not on the best of terms, huh? But I say fuck that. Oh, fuck that. The grunts stick together, huh? <laughs> I see. Oh, this is Remotely controlled lock. One thing's for sure. Our only chance of getting out of this alive, work together. Right. But now, what did they say about the garbage shoot? Okay, let's get our asses out of this place, then we'll go our separate ways. Huh? This is their contingency plan. There's a riot or an escape that just open the valve and turn the prison into one big gas chamber. Suki. Sure learn from their predecessors. Shh. We'll go as soon as the elevator leaves. Let's move. Sweet mother of God. I heard rumors of a concentration camp here, but to see it with my own eyes. There's a tunnel on the other side. Okay, I lead, you follow. Now keep it quiet, or they'll guess everyone. Let's move. Stay out of the light and stick to the shadows. They are your best friend. Okay, tak, 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 tak. Looks like we cleared it. Let's see, let's see. A great. Yeah, mm. Blia! Tough luck, didn't even budge, huh? All right, we can't go through here, that we know. Okay, where do we go now, huh? What if... Hey! Hey! Give me a lift, will you? Pretend you're a little fucking mouse. What? Get down. Don't make any sudden moves. See? Well, let's move. To think Careful, of yeah? like claws. You can do nothing but harm, and we Freeze. will save innocent lives just by shooting you. No, we're not going to shoot you. Thank you. Thank you. Pure say shooting move. is good for me. They deserve nothing more than hang. And it's a good show as well. <laughs> <laughs> Follow me. I don't quite agree with you on this. Fiora is infallible. Of course. The hanged man increases his bowels, and we have to clean it up. Okay, it's you take the right one, I the left one. I will distract mine, then you take yours down. Understand? Please. Get to it. Don't start too soon, huh? Let's do it! <laughs> How's this? We beat him to death with a shovel. Are you fucking hypnotized? Quit staring. Get to business. By the way, you're just going to give a speech today. And we have to work. You hear that? Sounds like something fell. A piece of plaster, perhaps. Still in here, the mirror. Yes, the prisoner. Prisoner 130. Did you make the noise? No, that wasn't me. I swear to God! All right, let's continue. Prisoner 78, did you hear a noise? Y yes, I did hear a noise, sir. What was that noise? The inmates are throwing bits of concrete at each other. But, but I don't know who did this this time, sir. If it happens again, call me at once. Joker is hanged. But if bonds... <laughs> As you say, sir. Huh? 
Just you look at that. Oh, you're lucky. I was afraid you'd fail. Hey, do you hear me? Look, there's a lever. It releases the ladder. If you pull it, get as many of them as you can. We're done anyway. You're gonna do squat besides get us all killed. Unscrew the light bulb. You go to that side. Maybe there you will be able to climb up. Let's meet on the top. Hey, Spartan! Break a leg. You're not here for a walk. Hey, man! Open the door! I need your discreet door. I would not want to be punished for your failure. In the guard room! What do you mean you released her? Are you out of your mind? I don't know. Just looked at him and somehow saw myself. And that trader from Hansa kept pestering me to sell the creature. Said it would be a waste to shoot it, that it'd pay good money, so I just... Show me the bullets. Sure, sure, look. I'm ready to share. It's too much for me alone. Just don't tell the Oberschaffung. I got 200 bullets! Well, well, why are you walking around here? It's just that our shift is in. Then you have no further business here. Off to the barracks with you. Yes, Herr Oberschaffung. I thought we had it bad. We are gonna move to the institution with this provoc. Don't get us in the kill! Shoot. Tired of you all. I wish they had just So You're good. But be careful. News? If they notice you, the we'll all be gas. Looks like nothing. Молодец, true hero. Now we need to get them to open the airlock from the other side. That button on the wall is the intercom. Push it. Oh, come on, push it. What kind of joke is this? Come on, quit fighting! Fritz, is that you? Damn it, I'm not gonna open next time! It's not even funny! Yeah! Let's play the fucking hide and seek now! Like freaking kids! Fritz! Get an airlock! Let us out! Let us out! 
There's a control panel up there. You can open all the cells. I can't stay here anymore. Please. I want to live. I want to live. You want to be in her blood? Round of fun is just starting, Billion. Here. Catch this. Hmm. Nice watch. Huh. This little blue indicator, it lights up when you're visible, huh? All right. There's bound to be more guards further ahead, but they won't be able to use gas here. We can really let ourselves go. Ah, I wish I had a grenade. No breaks to even the guard Let's move, here. You take the lower route, I'll take the top and cover you.
but Bavo acted like a real hero. Whoa. So, how are you, Chewbacca? All right? Oh, you are tough, huh? No wonder they made you a ranger. Follow me, don't stop. the impossible. Now I have to inform the Order that the Dark One is missing, which means to acknowledge that I've failed my mission. But now, when he's down in the metro, I won't be able to find him alone. I have to get to the nearest neutral station and then to Polis, the Order's HQ. Pavel will show me the way. What? Okay, looks like we lost them. Then we'd better hurry to the theater. There's nowhere else to go, huh? Chuvak. Are you alright, Chuvak? That's great. The armor works wonders. Shit! A dead end. Hold on! Whew. End of the line, huh? Well, there's no helping it. Поехали, we hoof it from here. Well, yes, uh, дорогой, I prefer riding too, but this train aren't going any further. The passengers are kindly asked to exit now. Блин, follow me. Hmm. No, I don't remember seeing this tunnel on any map. Phew, we're still on right track though. Be careful. Опа! Come here, Artyom! Artyom, get over here! Revolution are not waiting for one man, huh? Right! Okay. Wait here while I look around. Shit. 
Real fucking ninja. Let's take him to the guard post. And what if this fuck is not alone? Attention, second guard post. Check your sector of the tunnel. We caught a rat in the vents here. Stay sharp. There might be more. Roger. Checking that. Over. This is a fucking mess! A communist rat found in our tunnels! It's not the one I'm worried about. Right. Who knows how many more of those bastards are lurking in the shadows? All I know is we'd better find them. See anything? Let's go check the dead end out while we're at it. Just to make sure. So much as looked at you. That's it. You died or failed to be stood. Good evening. <laughs> Take me help from Belruska. There's a global there. He fell hard for one of the four. He started bullshitting her about the plan and probably to get some freebies. So, one day, the stupid bitch showed up at one of our boarding ports looking for me again. So what? Well, she was good looking and all, but. Uh... She has a tail. <laughs> All wolves have tail. No, a real tail. A little one like a puppy. They found her taking her measurement at the filtration camp. And Mikhail never noticed it. <laughs> but with Gashko heroes, he told Mikhail, you're a disgrace to the uniform. You'll punish the beast or hang next to her tomorrow. No more babies. Don't kill me. But what's a man to do? You can't beat the girl to death with a broom man. And he got off with a reprimand. Shit. From now on, I check for tails first. <coughs> oh, I called him. Second guard post. Report for situation. All clear. Over.
I surrender, you hear? I surrender! Let the big wigs duke it out! I heard enough! Pavel's almost certainly going to hang. Who knows? What would have happened to me had he not released me? Red, blue, yellow... What difference does that make? He risked his life for me. You don't get that much in the Metro. I can't just walk away on him. I knew it. You're a true comrade. I'm in your debt for life. Now get me out of here and I'll lead you home in no time. Fuck! Fuck, they're coming for me! Gonna take me to the noose! Good luck, my friend! You're my only hope now! Come on, get your ass out here, you fucking commie rat! <laughs> And since 
she's a whore, tell her I'm coming for a visit. And be careful what you say about my kids, you fuck. Or the next oh, one will be your right. brothers and sisters. <laughs> Wait, don't kill him yet. I have to go take a leave. Wait till I come back. Now I know you're crazy. If you're here, no one is watching your stash. So what? I've got the only key. Look, you could at least tell me what's in there. All these secrets. No secrets at all. It's a gun I got off one of those pesky police rangers we whacked last week. Cool costume shit. Respect me. Attention everyone. Roll call. Park, is there anyone alive there? Shit. They're getting on my nerves already. Will you go talk to them? Screw you. I went last time. Right, right. No big deal. I'll call myself. <laughs> Farm here, over. Damn this old piece of crap, when are they going to fix it? Spark's gone? Gone, my ass. But I told you, man, you shouldn't have sent that crab-handed guy to the camp. He was useful, even if he wasn't. Well, when we beat the shit out of Hansa, we'll have the techies, the whores, and whatever else you want 24-7. But in the meantime, we could go to the bridge and check out what's smoking there. You could do that yourself, just as well. out again. If you want something done, you better do it yourself.
Who's there? Don't shoot, man. Take anything. But please, don't kill me. Don't kill me, please. Picking on one of their own. Bastards. God, do I hate this life. People are worse than beasts. <laughs> I don't know a thing. Leave me. At the whorehouse. <laughs> yeah, that gun of yours is going to be so much fucking help when the reds come for your ass. I shot at my son this year. He keeps misbehaving at school. So I'll show him what awaits poor students. And what if they spare me? Send him to dig tunnels. They will lose. 
The moose is already over. What good is watching a guy hang anyway, huh? Jiggling with peace flowing down his legs. What happened to him? Still for morale. And it tightens this. Fuck. Let's play cards. A bullet ahead. for 20 years, even before the ride. You're my only friend. I need help. Sure, I'll help you. Yeah? Shaking. Come on, spit it out. It's about Mark. What? Something about the baby? She's supposed to deliver soon, right? She already did. I didn't hear. Congratulations, man. Boy or girl? Boy, but he's... He's got hair all over him. On his face, too. Martha's been hiding him. She hasn't left the tent. I don't know what to do, Serge. Jesus. Well, the law says you gotta give it up. And then you try again. Your wife's healthy.
давай, проклятие заклемённый мир, рабочий и рабок. I dragged Pavel out of the noose, and he says he's going to take me as close to police as possible. Then I'll contact the Order and report on everything that has happened. The path to the legendary theater lies through the catacombs. I've never been here before, and without my new friend I'd probably be completely lost. I hope he knows the way. <laughs> That's the way to do it, bro! Just like the three musketeers, I, if there were two of them. <clears throat> you ever read the book? Really confusing, but I fucking loved it. Always wanted to be a toss. Uh, you can be D'Artagnan, huh? All right, we're short on time. We go to theater from here, then you of the police. I have got home to get another, okay? I don't like how you do the chase and run the game behind us. Not a good sign. Shit! Fifth, come in! Andre! Fifth here. Cut the lights in that house. They are dead now. Got that! Dead meat! You, my you! What the hell? Oh, we just have to see about that. Ah, to hell with us. There is no big deal, Sebastian. Moscow is right behind us. Forward! Stop! Blood. That's why the Nazis cut the light. These things hate it. Okay, Spartan, a short lesson. Bullets won't cut it here. But since they are afraid of light, let's take the light to them, okay? Like they blew the tunnel up. Well, maybe something on the other side they couldn't stop with bullets. Wait, 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 wait. I feel a draft. There's got to be a way through somewhere. Artyom, help me with this.
These little ones couldn't make all of this. There must be bigger beasts around. Chuck, be careful not to wake them up. Shit! They're close! Wait, Artyom, don't trust! Careful here. Looks clear to me. Let's go! That's high. Definitely no climbing up this one. Okay. Let's hope the elevator works all right. Yes! Generator online. Here. Monsieur? Let's take this baby for a ride, huh? Artyom, come on! So, are we going? What the... Why did it stop? Breakers are out of work. Shit. Come on! Blyat! They hand us. You may we're right in their fucking nest. Shit! It's a lot of them. Yeah. It's got the hook! <laughs> Seeds belly? That's the only vulnerable spot. Their top armor's just too tough. Okay, Artyom, if we run into one of these things, put your light on it till it flips belly up, you understand? The bastards hate the light more than anything. Come on, follow me. Fucking this! Artyom! Light! Right, Black! There you have it, bitch! Whew. Thanks, Chuak. One for all, huh? Here! The bridge. I heard about it. The other shouldn't be far now. It's all right, Artyom, jump! Let's move! Ah, them again! Hold them off, Artyom, I'll try to get us over! Great! This will do it! Artyom! Artyom! Come help me pull this out! Now don't you turn that light off. Understand we're in a world of hell without it.
Do like I do. Give you a lift. Shit! Get inside! I'm too, a hand! Let's go! You all right, Artyom? Come on! Let's go! Let's go! How do you like this, huh? How do you like this, bitches? What? Okay, we're safe here. Wait a minute, Artyom, it's, it's bad without the light. Let me make a torch or something. All right. Light up! All right, let's go. Shit, looks like there's an electric lock. Okay, the wires go... Oh, over there. Hey, look, D'Artagnan, you've got the light. If you follow the wires, there should be a fuse box somewhere. It used to power the gate, but the battery is surely dead now. When you find it, attach your charger to it. Then we'll try to open the door, okay? Now, don't worry about me. I'm a toss. I'll strike them down with my steel.
Oh, that was cool. Genius. Good thinking. Ready? Okay. First up. Follow me. We're almost at the theater now. The metro entrance should be pretty close. But however small the distance is, we'll have to cover it on the surface. And there, every step you take could well be your last. Chuvak, we're here. Pull yourself together. We don't have long before nightfall, okay? Okay, with the tunnel collapsed, the only way to reach the escalator down to the other station is cross the surface. And trust me, we don't want to be caught out here in the fucking dark. Opa, we're in luck, Artyomich! This place seems lived in. Rangers probably, I don't know. And when there are rangers? Shit! Short on filters. We'll have to make do. Now come on, take what you need. We're all brothers in the metro. Hey, Prieti, I could use a good watch like yours. Knowing how much air you got left is a must, huh? We have no further business here. Let's move forward. You know, I've heard of things roaming around that even bullets can stop. You have been through some bad shit, I know, but not like what's coming. Achum, remember. If you want to live, don't drop your guard for an instant, okay? Whoa, that's impressive! I heard about this place. That plane was headed into Moscow when the whole city caught fire. Uh, the building where it crashed, that's the entrance of the theater. The ice is towing up here. It's almost like spring, huh, Artyomich? Maybe we'll live to see the summer. Wait, 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 wait. There's got to be an underground path somewhere around here. The rangers would never cross the square out in the open. Okay, we could walk down the wing here. Okay, so much for the sun. Those clouds move in fast.
There's the crossing. Let's head it there. Hey, Priyaki. Keep your headlight charged. Watch my back cover your corner. Slowly now. Anything good there, my friend? So, let's move. Check for filters, Artyom. You want to swap your mask? Do it fast. This poor bastard won't be needing his. Yup, very much. Ugh, yeah. I think I'm gonna be sick. Tread carefully. They say these tunnels shelter more than just movement. A good communist doesn't believe in souls, Artyom. But this fucking place of death makes me, uh, wonder. to the light. Check that service room. You okay, Chubak? You're all covered with blood. I don't stop! Get out now! Watchmen! Show my a huge bag! The storm must be driving them. Ooh, I smell trouble. If they spot us, they're ripped to shreds. That was close. Okay, Artyom, no more tricks like that. Let's get to the plane before another pack comes through. Move it! Uh, I've heard stories about this place. Weird shit happens here. To the emergency hatch! Hey, try opening it, I'll give cover! Jump! Oh, bleh, let's try together! Oh. Look, Artyom, don't lose your head in here, you understand me? Okay, let's go! One ranger told me this was a flight from Mallorca. Family is returning from vacation, you know? You know, Artyom, I've never been to the sea. Or even in a plane, myself. Yeah, well, wasn't meant to be. I feel... I don't know, I feel... weird. Chuck, are you seeing this shit too? Artyom, what is this? Show my you! Look! They're alive!
the way. Where? Suffocated like the others did. What? Like this one? <laughs> like this one here. Okay. 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 Let's get out of this place now. Now. Artyom, go right. I think we'll find the entrance behind the building. Shit, the demon! Take it down! Take it down! Someday a creature like you will take me. Not yet, okay? Fucking watchman, as soon as we moved away from the plane, and we were almost there, huh? Around the next corner, we have to move now. Follow me faster, faster. Come over here. Go. Give me a hand. Faster. More are coming. We have you gonna find the end.
Our short visit to dead Moscow, the phantom of the past, is over. Pavel and I helped each other out again, and are returning down to the metro as real partners now. You can't survive the wastelands any other way. But now ahead of us lies a populated station, the theater. It's very close to Polis. If Pavel manages to lead me through the red line guard posts, I'll be home in less than an hour. Okay, come on in. Sorry about that. Dangerous times, right? We're going up soon. Are there many watchmen around? We were lucky to get here. Okay, there's a nest in the building by the wrecked plane. Yeah, London is such a bad dream today. Oh, you want a nightmare? Oh, it's waiting for you up there. No sense going with just three men. <laughs> To clear a nest, we need a couple squads at least. So what now? You're not going? We need to gather the men first. We're waiting for the guys. On their way. Then we'll give the beasts some hell. You cool. Come on in. Well, if you enlist, they acknowledge you as a person. But anyone deemed unnecessary is chased off or hung. So you're here. Is that all of you, or are more coming? We're all here. Two trains, as agreed. Our people from the first one, did they get permission to enter? Still waiting. They're giving our chief help, but there's nothing he can do about it. So, maybe while they're talking, you could let us in? No, we can't. Sorry, that's forbidden, without a permit. How about just the kids? And leave the parent here? No, you better just wait there. But you did let the first group in. No, they're sitting on their train at the transfer track. Be grateful you're on the platform where you have some space. Understood. Listen, everyone. How could this happen? Our step We've been in the wreck all our lives, here. and now so we're free? Ugh, this happens all the time. So, that's our plan. The station next to this one is Revolution Square. One of ours. Red. And Revolution is spitting distance to police. So, I, as a good communist, which I am, will vouch for you. They'll have to let you through, and you'll be home in no time. What do you think? Are you the one they just told us about? Yes, we are. Great. Come in, then. So, my Spartan friend, have a look around. There's plenty to see here, huh? I'll talk to my people and find you. Welcome, and have a good rest. But you do understand that we can't wait here forever. Look, I don't make the rules, okay? Who does that? to the last surviving theatrical critic. Bullets for mercy on your souls. So, young man, I see you like my witty side. Myself. Here we sit, with drinks, and party lights, when all around us radiation, death, decay, and endless war. Death and decay. That's exactly what the we want. Yeah. That is really a reason. Is it something new? Sorry. Mushroom soup. Mushroom soup. Yeah. Gee, what happened? But really, they're just dumping the dependents. Wow. That's a demon. So scary, just like the real thing. A demon. Look at it flapping its wings. It's attacking. No. Dad says it flaps its wings like this when taking off. And my dad saw lots of demons. We're right, Uncle Misha. This is a demon? Well, it's 
<laughs> All right, let it be a demon. But there used to be birds like that. So, Nikitich, when do we become your father? Have you got enough money to last a week? A week? Two days, maybe. Then my life is over. And it took so long to save up. Oh, well. Good readings. At least I had some fun. Well, the case is not new. You give up bullets. These are well made. Shit. You can still make it to start. These bullets are good. Hey, despite me, him. I got money for three days. Yeah, best Drink stopping me. power of them all. Simply the best. These knives, best for taking care of citizens. Best thing to have when there's many of them and only one of you. Good luck! Come again! Fish! Grenades. Fresh fish from Venice! Fish, smoked, dried, salted. Perfect self-defense weapons! Best prices! Incendiary grenades! Guaranteed to keep your enemy warm! to drop by. Buy an insurance for your safety. Protect yourself and your loved ones. Ammo and gear for sale. Bullets exchange. This is great stuff. Cooking the best you find. We spend the entire... Well, Artyom, I made all the arrangements. We can go to the revolution now. They will let us in through the field. We've seen on the revenge at the platform hiding from his wife. Come on, don't make us laugh. I just can't hit a woman. You are the Hey, you! Stop! Show me your tickets! Did you hear that? Sure. Come in. Well, Stanislavski, you can watch the show if you like. I'll wait for you at the dressing room. Maestro, if you'd be so kind, the captain. No, I feel enjoyed sorry the show. For the other performance now. Sorry, Their man. Time to move on. Audience, you my patron of the such art. A spectacle. But <laughs> I trust they will handle the race far of our expectations. Oh, and thus, Pavel Ivarovich. So continues. glad to see this you. Man Where have you spits been? In the eye of you don't like Challenges us anymore. Defies the god. Helen, no, no, I'm, I'm totally in love with you girls, but I've been busy with work. I'm, I'm very, very sorry. I'll come Our back soon. I promise. Yeah, teach you to Google. Extraordinary. With his, uh, in your dreams, you have your words. Use that. It's no good. Why can't your boyfriend buy you something better? Our boyfriend is cheap, that's why. No, he's reliable and he doesn't waste his money. In that case, you should just marry him. Ali, go! Anyways, I tell you, we should be going, but uh, let's dream to the fact we're still alive. Huh? It's on me, okay? 
Here you are. Do over a special from the old stock. Been infusing it for half a year. Opa! That's great! So, let's drink, Artyom! Smooth stuff, huh? And this is a good place, but nah, home is the best, you know? You know, I've traveled all over the metro and people talk all kinds of shit about the red line. That it's awful there, that there's no food, that we shoot comrades for nothing, and you can't even tell a joke without getting arrested. Wait, let's have another drink. Here goes, Artyom! Wow, so... <clears throat> Yes, our life is a bit strict. One party, one leader, one ideology, but we have order. And everything is shared. Food, medicine, fuel, shelter. No rich men, true. But no beggars either. Another drink. And now, to equality. Come on, Artyom. No, 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 no. Pay that now. Ooh, Ah, uh, where was I? Ah, uh, yes. Yes, look, look at the far stations. They freaking eat each other, sell their kids as slaves. It's like the Stone Age. And after his own devices, a man becomes a beast, you know? Order, order is all that matters. That's, that's our salvation. So you can believe whatever, but I am red. I am red until the day I die. I drink to order. Blin. Come on, Artyom, come on! Bottoms up! Bottoms up! So, my friend, that's how it goes. Don't be mad, Artyom. Just doing my job to protect the red line. And you, Musketeer, are from the wrong side of the barricade. Privates, take this comrade in. Yes, Major, sir. Yes, sir. It is private. That was so stupid of me. I bought that talk of friendship. The stupid musketeer saying, Just you wait, and we'll get even. I wonder though, why did Pavel go through the trouble of trapping me? Move it! Hey, stop that, bleh! It's just being over enthusiastic, you know? Artyom, look, I think of you as my friend, really. But as a soldier, you understand that I had to follow my orders and bring you here, okay? Now you're under arrest, but perhaps it's not the end of the line for you. I hope. We, the people of the Red Line, Good day, sir. Good day, sir. At ease, Tavarish. So, you're doing good here? Are you not? Yes, sir. Comrade Moskvin is here, inspecting the troops. The Secretary General here? What about Comrade Korn? Yes, sir. Comrade General is here, too. Opa, it's my lucky day, huh? Okay, things are moving faster than we anticipated. Look, it's you. You're a smart guy, so you understand there is no such thing as coincidence. You are here because we need you. You have information. So, my advice to you, my friend? Cooper. Okay? But don't worry, I got your back. Because we are what? Musketeers! All for one, and one for all. But your comrades in the order, their motto is all for us. War is coming, my friend. That bunker you guys found, whoever controls it survives and fuck the rest of us. But we have been preparing for this. And I want you to join us, too. Comrade General! Comrade Morozov, I was beginning to think you had not survived your mission. I was captured, Comrade Corbot. This ranger here, uh, Satan. What a coincidence. He's Nitsky, one of the Spartan Rangers. Do you know this man? Yes, sir. His name is Artyom. Miller trusts him. They found the six together. He's also earned several commendations since officially enlisting with the Order. 
Well, I am overjoyed to meet you, Camerad Archim. I think we both have something to offer. Take the comrade to the negotiation room. Young man, let's dispense with the introductory probing and cut the chase. Hmm? This telepathic mutant, the so-called Dark One, is of extreme scientific significance. Tell me all you know about it, and I will allow you to keep your life and your job with the Rangers. <laughs> but, as my spy, an operative, just like those uh, musketeers, one for all, and all for... Secretary General Comrade Moskvin. Corbut, I need a moment. And what do we have here? Another enemy of the revolution? <laughs> Perfect. As you have always noted, Lonya must start learning how to improve his uh, people skills. As a matter of fact, we were. Yeah, put away your truth serums. I'll show you a more traditional Red Army method. Faster and more effective. You shit! Spill your guts now! Tell everything you know of these six! Huh? Protocols. What are you doing, Dad? This is called interrogation, Lonya. Interrogation. Business as usual. What? You never did that playing dolls? No! You little shit! There's no power without blood! There is! Your brother ruled peacefully, and they still love him! Get back here! God damn it! Butcher! All right. Use your drugs. Use hot pokers! Just get everything out of him! And shoot the bastard! And then come to my office. We must talk. Come back here! You may be my son. Oh, I must agree with Leonid. Brutality is a crooked path to information. I believe in science. One injection and you will tell us everything. I need you to go to Venice and take care of the locals who made the delivery. This will not be a cash payment. Understand? Completely, sir. And uh, what about the Dark One? The creature has been located. The details are in this envelope. You will pick up the animal right after you go to Venice. Don't disappoint me this time. I won't, Comrade General. I, uh, I won't. Revolution and my own future! I'd rather be shot and end up like father, killing his own brother. Listen, if you get out of here, just, well, just live! Here, get in there! This is the way to freedom. Believe me, I know. <laughs> I spent all my childhood hiding from my father in those vents.
Titan, sit down, Corp. Let's talk. About the negotiations in Polis? Ah, so you already know. I am the head of intelligence, after all. Then why did you let the information leak? Damned refugees. Polis, Hansa, and even the fucking Nazis already know about our plans. The rats will be exterminated. And war is inevitable anyway. Inevitable? I have my doubts. So does the Politburo. A doubtful man is a fearful man. How dare you! You're the head of state security, and you report to me! Yes, but now, when we are one step away from a unified Red Metro, you have no right to disrupt the plan. I have no right? I'm... Moscovin, when you asked me how to deal with your elder brother when he was still the Secretary General, I helped you. And after his tragic death, I bucked your takeover. So I suggest you take my advice again. This is unacceptable. It's very simple, Comrade Moskvin. We all stand together, arms linked against the wind. Or it's every man for himself. But, Corbett, is this whole fucking metro truly worth the blood we're going to spill? I have a way of doing it without spilling any blood. No blood, you say? All right. Go do your trick. I'll handle the Politburo. Cuz... One of these days. A frontal assault is hopeless. But if we go underground with the church, advance through the catacombs, then attack from the rear, we should encounter little or no resistance. Then we just have to do a sweep. Attention! Comrade General! Soldiers, you are trusted with an important mission. Each group has its task. And you have been told only what you need to know to succeed. But remember that this operation is top secret, and you must not be taken alive by the enemy. I hope that I am understood. Questions? Can we use radios after we capture the assigned targets? Only in case of emergency, and on a scrambled frequency. If we're faced with strong enemy counterattacks, do we hold the positions or fall back? Hold them. Anyway. The enemy is unlikely to mount an effective counter-offensive. Comrade General, we have been issued a banner along with the other gear, but we were also made to remove all our markings. We will leave no trace of our operation. Only upon victory and receipt of the following signal will you raise your banner over the captured targets. Further questions? No, Comrade General. Good luck, then. Surrender! Surrender! Right. 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 Now I am in a real spider-infested catacombs, where the General Secretary Moskvin does not look like the head spider. That title clearly belongs to General Corbett. I sure would like to know what's on his mind. What did Lesnitsky bring him from D6? What's going to destroy the enemies of the revolution? Only questions and no answers. The only thing that is clear, Pavel has information on the Dark One, which makes him my current target.
You got it yourself. I'll go stand there around the corner. Piss your pants already? <laughs> then watch a real man. Well, if you're a real man, why are your hands shaking? Hands don't mean shit. The important thing is nothing else shakes. Okay. Composed. Composed. The red wire. Come on. Don't rush me. How long is it gonna take? Almost there. <laughs> Mines already. First you order a patrol, then you expect me to sit here. Second pole, come in. Second pole. What the hell? What am I supposed to do? Split in two? Second pole's here. Second pole, report your situation. Reporting. Group 8 left the facility using Tunnel 2. Roger that, second boss. Carry on. What? What the hell are you doing here? Who's gonna patrol the premises? Me alone? Come on, get to work, all of you! Yes, sir. Ivan, stay! Did you take care of the rats? I want them all burnt! Commander, we're not Nazis. Shooting is one thing, but we can't burn people alive. What do you mean? People? Shooting? Are you out of it? Aren't you talking about the refugees? What refugees? Let the special department handle them. I'm talking real rats, tails and all. They've multiplied like crazy. So you go and do it! On the double! Yes, sir.
Well, guys, looks like they're determined to make us work. Let's find some stuff to do. Quick. All right, I'll go move some boxes there. Great. I'll look busy here, too. <laughs> make it look good and we'll keep them off our asses. All, All right. right. It's the only thing that kept me alive. But what the hell happened? Why? You don't know about the bridge? Sure, I know the place. I served there for a short time. Well, last year there was one hell of an incident. The guy said that when they came to relieve the watch, all of the sentries on our side of the bridge were dead. So the lieutenant sent some scouts to the Nazi post on the other end. They returned and said it was the same ship there. Their boots were stained red, like they'd been through a river of blood. Who could have killed so many men? Whatever it was, it wasn't human. Might have been a creature some called a dark rail tracer. One of the guys supposedly made him mad by taking a nut off on a rail junction. That's ridiculous. If it wasn't a rail tracer, the story is even crazier. 
Must have been a Hanzar police task force. How could a task force that size get there undetected? Now, one guy that's possible. I heard of a traitor who smuggled a spy of some kind to the front line through the smithy in a rail car undercarriage. But 30 guys? Ah, eh, that's too complex. We'll never know. But somehow, it happened. Huh? They've tripled the guards at the bridge since then. We tripled. Hey you, down there! Watch out for your head! More than you have shit already stored to capacity. These things are really growing like stalkers. Shut up, it's our job. Just be happy they don't make you collect this crap on the surface. Not yet. Are there going to be any more deliveries today? Well, that was the last one. Great. I'm taking a smoke break. Don't take too long. You know what happens to those who fail to turn up at roll call?
I'm ready. Okay, let's handle this one. Blow red. Normal. Heat exchange of temperature. Nominal. Compressor speed. Okay, ladna. Synthesis gas pressure. All right. Catalyst stay. A okay. Methanol output at the separator. Standard. Great, got that. To the third. What? Speed. Nominal. Synthesis gas pressure. A okay. Heat exchange of temperature. All right. Great, got that. <laughs> Congratulations. The service check is complete. Bye bye. How about the smoke break? Yeah, sure thing. You're free till tomorrow.
Accept the delivery and sign the manifest? I sure did. Where did you put the goods? Wherever I had space left. Top shelves mostly. Can you be more specific? Specific? Wherever I left the ladder. There's our goods. My ship's nearly over. Best of the other guy when he arrives. All right, all right. I'll go and check if everything's still there. Watch from here. One day soon, your luck goes to the 
duty there? Yeah, it's a creepy place. The station's nearby. There's the machine gun, the searchlight, where comrades are around. There's something rustles in the cobwebs and the sound just freezes blood. Why not burn those webs? We do that all the time. In a couple of weeks, the damn beast and everything covered with that shit. Damn, they sure are a lot of trouble. Maybe we should just weld the gate shut and be done with it. And what if we had to get to Venice fast? How will we go there? Take a train to Hansa territory? Forget it. The only way is to keep that damn watch there. Spider. What then? How should I know? 
looked like a human with a large bag at that. But when I lit the place up, there was nothing. Don't worry about it. Weird shit starts happening after a six-hour watch. Maybe. But somebody is stealing the parts and food. Probably one of ours. Waiting till our backs are turned, then selling shit to Hansa. Either way, the brass better not hear you talk. If you say too much, they'll pin it on you. Stay down, or your brain goes splat! Wait a minute. Artyom, is it you? I was able to send the report back to the Order via my old acquaintance, Andrew the Blacksmith. At least Miller will know that I am alive, that I haven't completed the mission, but haven't resigned from it either. That's one serious pickle you're in. But I can help. I have friends, and they have friends, who can relay everything you tell me to your guys from the Order. So, now you must return home to Polis? Well, there's no direct route. Everything's cordoned off here. But I believe the Order has an outpost nearby. On the surface, the church and the marshes. Try that place. If we can get word to your people, they might meet you there. As for me, I started life anew, left Kuznetsky most. The Reds completely subverted the place, looking for traitors and spies, sending people to camps, or just shooting them, all because of the coming war. People are fleeing from Kuznetsky most and their whole Red Line. Did you see the armored train the Reds are building? Well, we built something too, with the stuff the refugees are bringing. Here, take a look. At this baby, the boys even gave her a name. You can't help but fall in love with her. She did a swell job roaming refugees. But hell, you can't save everyone. So, take it. We have people in Venice, too. When you get there, find Woodpecker and tell him where you left our baby. Climb aboard! All right, start the engine. We're still tinkering with her, so the controls aren't perfect. But the lights are first class. No need to fear the spider bugs around her. And there's a lot of those in the far tunnels. You should go. It's a long way, so you shouldn't waste any time.
Pavel's group is advancing towards Tretikovskaya, also known as Venice. They have a few hours lead on me and are moving via frequently used tunnels. But I will catch up. I can't afford not to.
Stand still or we shoot. We're armed. We are armed. Swear by Lenin's name. He doesn't look like a GB. I don't recognize the uniform. Could he be one of ours? Look at all his weapons. Don't shoot! We are civilians! There are women and children here! Leave and let leave, okay? We're refugees from the Red Line. I'm in charge here, basically. No, there's nobody under my command. All the battle-worthy men went with the other caravan. Half a click ahead. I thought they'd protect us. But they were. We heard the shooting. It subsided. But it doesn't look like our people survived. So we can't go any further. And if we go back, it's the firing spot for us. You look like you've seen your share of fights. Can you help us? It's not for me, but I pity the children. So what do we do now? How do we live without them? They might still be alive. Don't bury them yet. But the shooting, the shooting was so loud. And now there is nothing. And what if they want? These are great boots. Why? Why don't they come some for us Some buckshot in the gut they sure might makes any soon. bandit a dull boy. Let's just wait. Buy some. This is you just a they... thing for bandits. They hey, killed them Come on, buy these. can find them anywhere else. Or these knives much. are the best weapon How? if thrown with them. Are with them. Yasha. If ah, the incendiaries. I wish someone bought these and made some bandit roast. So are we going to help See our ya. guys or what? One help can just the two of us be. If they're pinned down, we could flank the bandits. Let's get ready then. Well, you're not going anywhere. Who is going to protect the women and children? But we can't let the bandits butcher our guys. That stranger is going to help us. Looks like he's worth 20 of you anyway. You are an idiot to believe you're Andre the Blacksmith. Oh, it's safe. You'll get there in no time. And you dragged me here. And now we're all gonna die because of your stupid blacksmith. Shut your mouth. Andre is safe. He got us all out and lots of people before us. Sure, he got us out just to be robbed by bandits. And how the hell was he supposed to know about the bandits? Then he shouldn't tell people and say, that's bullshit. How about the TV? Shit here. Might have missed some bullets or whatever. Well, move your ass. 
The other guys are probably back home already. I've dropped. Hey, looks like there's. Thanks. Thanks, man. I thought... I thought I was done for. They took everyone still alive. The kids, the women. I'll move the rail car so that you can drive through. If you follow them, be careful in the technical tunnel. I heard the bandits talk about the trap there. I'll just rest here for now.
To God, you. The boss said if we let just one fist they fight, he's gonna have our ass. No sheep. We're good.
Stations of all the lives. Where the tongue terminates, and guys make a fire, drink, play cards. So, sometimes, one of those guys just stands up and walks off into the tunnel. And that's fucking it. So, if you ask the guy where he's going, he says, I've been summoned by the master. And once a person is summoned, even if you tie them to their bunks, they'll just chew their ropes off and run off into the tunnel. Damn, that shit. <laughs> How about some tea?
okay, you can tell me the tale later. Right now we're entering the fairway and plotting a course to the base. The snow on the surface starts melting. The familiar rail cars are now joined with boats and fishermen. One of them appeared just in the nick of time. Soon we'll be docked at Venice. Pavel is most probably already there. I don't usually fish in this tunnel, but I had a hunch they'd be biting pretty good here. in that world. See for yourself pretty soon. Grab the railing when I want it. This tunnel leads to Revolution Square and the Red Line. I saw a boat coming in from there today. Mm, some serious dudes. No refugees. <sighs> Stay quiet now. They don't like noise. And this is their work. <laughs> See how they just rest there? <laughs> easy, easy. They're not here to harm you. Nobody knows what they mutated from. We call them creeps. Ooh, ugly as hell. Good eating, especially with me.
Oh, wow. This doesn't happen often. Looks like we lucked out. The subterranean Venice, an island on the dark waters of underground rivers. You always hear rough stories circulating about this place. I hear it is all one huge den of thieves. But there is something I know for sure. Pavel reached Venice, and if I'm not late, he's still here. Finding the Dark One is still my main mission. But now I see I must also uncover Corbett's plans so that I can warn the Order about them. Wow. Oh, seems like we made it. Hey, are you asleep there? What do you think of the local fish, huh? Aren't they charming? Mm, seem moody, though. Looks like somebody went through there before us and angered them. Open up! The fishermen are back from the seas! Yeah, I see you all right. And who might that be? I picked the guy up in the tunnel. You don't think I should have left him there, do you? What? And make my life easy? Of course not. First is red, no, please put this in. And I keep raising a lower the gate. You can bring a girl for once. And what would you do with one if I brought her, Semenovich, huh? You're way too old for that stuff. By the way, you better lower the gate, or else a woman might actually come. The one dressed in black and bearing a sight. <laughs> Never fear. Semenovich is going to outlive you all. Hey, Fidor, how's fishing? Uh, not even a bite, unless you count the shrimps. And they got a few more out of me than I'd like. I was saved by this lad, Artya. Nice to meet you, Artyom. Thanks for your help. So what exactly did happen? The shrimps were all over us as soon as we got to the fork. Almost took my raft apart. Uh, what the hell gives? I wonder. Oh, that's easy. The Reds passed through here, going to meet our esteemed neighbors. Didn't seem to care what they stirred up. Ah, so that's why. Look, Artyom, I suppose there is no hiding. Venice is full of gangsters. Jules, the scum of the earth. So don't you start any shit. I don't want any trouble. Simon! Hey! Simon! I want to talk to you! Look, do you know where might our red guests be? In the brothel, of course. Who's that with you? This is Artyom, the scourge of the shrimps. <laughs> you should see him shoot. <laughs> I never met anyone quite as good as him. A gunslinger, eh? Would you help me take out a few bad guys? Simon, I freaking knew it. This is getting old. But almost all of them are gathered at the storage facility. Look, if this isn't the right time, I don't know what is. Between the two of us, we might be able to take them out. I told you countless times already, and I'm going to tell you again. No! I don't need the shit around here. Do you get me? Yeah, I got you. Right. Then I'm going to leave you two. Okay. <laughs> An station of criminals. How is it he's in charge? Hey, Simon. You're good with engines, aren't you? Yeah, what's up? Yeah, I don't know. It was all right yesterday, now it's all coughing and spitting smoke. Ignition, perhaps? Well, let's take a look. How about the cylinders? No, they couldn't have cracked those. A knock like that would turn it all upside down. How about the carburetor? Ah, 
Young man, I've got a few bullets to spare. I'm a bit short for one project. How about one more? Not moving at all! Ugh. It's my back! That's my back! I wonder what the great hey, neck that fish! Move your tail! I'm exhausted already! Damn this shit! Can't move it an inch! What the hell? You're some damn fine girls! Don't get cocky, man. We whack you, there'll be people fighting over this place. They all know it better than you. Right. The boys will love you. Oh, what do we have here? This is worse. Well, the street is short of belly. Look, you're not from here, so could you help a local man out with a bullet or two? I wish we had more visitors like you here. Thank you! Can't even look at this. Could you please get some bread? Where am I supposed to get bread? Sunken tunnels everywhere, and if you go to Novokuznetskaya, you're as good as dead, probably. Seems like you're out of options. So, here's the deal. You could just stay here with us. You're young, tough, you can handle things, and we'll find you a job in no time. Especially since most of those newcomers here are just human refuse from Novokuznetskaya. Just think about it. You start working with our fishermen, get a bit acquainted with things, then you might actually like it. We could even find you a nice girl. Well, I won't pressure you. Go get some rest for now, and try to stay out of trouble. The gangsters seem to be jumping. Sorry I can't walk you around. I have some stuff to do. So, go have some fun at the shooting range, perhaps. Sorry I can't talk too much with you today. Let's wait until the Reds get out and things calm down, okay? Great.
what did you say? Get out! But we've been here for half an hour already. You freaking don't get it, do you? Do you know who I am? Let's take this outside. Why is that road talk? No need. What did I say? Out! All right, all right. And take your shit with you. Sure thing. What's taking you so long? Hey, come take our order now. All right, talk quiet. Don't scare the girl. They'll be right. That's unusual. New face! Hello! Are you going to stay here for some time? On business, perhaps? You'd rather not tell? Why do you need all those bullets? Fine by me. A shame, though. We don't get many guests here. Most of the visitors are gangsters, and they are not good with small talk. <laughs> but if it wasn't for them, there'd be nothing at all to talk about. You can only say so much about the brothel and the rat shooting range. And for the gangsters, that was Ennis. The brothel, by the way. It's quite all right. The Reds went there as soon as their boat was docked. Hmm. Perhaps your business is with those communists. No, no, no need to get tense. <laughs> You're in a bar. Only one bullet will get you out special. It's called the bullet. Also, so you can't say it isn't a fair trade. My guest. <laughs> Good stuff, ain't it? Another one. I have some really kick-ass guns here. Fresh inventory. What the fuck are you looking at? Scrap. Some sleep now. Come get your nuggets. Fresh meat was running about just minutes ago. Come get your nuggets. That's what I call a dance. You should join the Bolshoi engine. Hey! What about the money? That's one fine woman! Get it from your local boss, bitch. Sure. We don't have bosses here. Cop it out, you crazy. All the trouble getting yeah, here was worth it. Easy. Are you sure? Great. I have to serve all his friends for free and still pay him his cut. Sick and tired of his wife. What good is it all? I'd be better off on the farm, feeding the pigs. We had some fun, now it's time for work. So, first thing, we pay Kinsley and you head it to Comrade Corbett. Tell him the virus container's been successfully delivered to Oktyabrska, okay? Hey, pretty boy. Let's Why go. are you just standing business to attend? Hey, why is he unhappy? He just don't feel it. 
Oh, basically signed her death warrant. <clears throat> Can't wait to touch me, can you, Daragoy? Well, if you want it that bad... What kind of dance would you like, sweetie? Tell me, don't be shy. I'm quite imaginative. Make yourself comfy, sweetie. So how do you like the dance, Daragoy? I see you liked it pretty much. Come on, baby. If you decide to come back, I'm always around. That's one fine woman! No fucking reason to stay here. These are some good bullets, even though they're handmade. They make this real good. You should get some while you can. Come here, don't be shy. Nice bullets these are. Never had a problem with them. Look, buddy, you won't find better ammo anywhere. Incendiaries are great. Scare the shit out of everyone. Well, well, come back anytime. I'll always be happy to help you. Incendiaries! Get the fire started! Check where you Hey, how about a try? Cheaper than mushrooms. Come on in. Come on, get yourself some. What's our limit then? You're the one who came here. Shoot straight! Like Shoot fast! Shoot at our range! The rules are simple. You take position and kill all the critters. If you make it before the signal, you can collect your winnings. Take position, please! Good for shaving! I bet he's not hitting anything! Yeah. What's the bet? Nice shot. Yeah. Two to one. Yeah. If he hits everything. <laughs> I'm even alright with three. He ain't hitting shit. Alright. It's a deal. Dre, here's your winning. How about the race? Anyone looking for grenades? Targets are waiting. I have some really kick-ass guns. Bullets, knives, explosives for sale here. Oh, that's something. He actually hit. Ah, he's a bad guy. can get lucky. Let him hit once more. See that? He hit again. He blew it for sure. Hey, you. Why are you spoiling my bet? Fresh meat nuggets. Great prices today. Come get your nuggets. Dre, here's your winning. I have some really good about the race? Fresh inventory. Be my Bullets, guest. Nice grenades, all for sale here. Looks like you might be in for three bucks. No way. He's missing the next one. Hey, what's the hell? Hit again? He's a bad shot. Definitely. It's getting interesting now. Just take my dick. Good aim. Shit. Only one left. Ah, uh, he ain't hitting that one. That was something. Here's a special prize for you. 
The target's usually last till the evening. Well, our barbecue is going to be busy for a while now. So much, I was at a loss. What should you say? This person helped your teddy bear come home, so what should you say? Thank you. Thank you, you're a godsend. Simon brought that teddy bear from the surface. Toys are scarce here, as you know. So he grew really fond of it. How about we go home now? Can I play here some more? All right, but not for long. We'll go home soon. Fresh meat nuggets, great prices today. Come get your nuggets. Real guns for real men. Get your gun here. Fresh meat nuggets, great prices today. Come get your Later. nuggets. Later, come by any time. I have some really kick ass guns here. Fresh inventory. He gave us a case last time he was here, and Keithley sent it off to Octyoroskaya. Said he was full of flyers for the working people. Flyers, my ass! That case had a lock. So, what was in there? I wish I knew. Check this 
Sasha Yorcha. So is he coming to check on us or what? He's coming, all right. Well, I've had enough Something goddamn waiting here. He could have gone to take a leak or something. What's your problem, bro? My problem is I got no watch, so I don't know how much time I'm wasting here. <laughs> Is that right? Yes, that's true. Then they have a new freak. You know, small, black skin, nothing but bones and eyes, and that feeling in your belly that if you don't stop looking hey, at it, you will that that that. uh, That's the main attraction. Quarter of the night or something. Small little creature, but when it starts stirring, it's deep. Okay, so I have some new business nah, for you. I too need much room, A lot. Pay twice the usual. Double dead and we're talking. All right, you got it. But you have to move quick. The fifth is yours along with whatever mess he makes. <laughs> hey, uh, how about a glass of tea? Just got the new batch to spill. A little drink before you go? All right, just a little. Drop your weapon, Blit. Hands behind your head. Well, 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 what an unexpected encounter. Looking for the Dark One? Huh? Well, maybe there is a hope for you and Polis. But then, you're too late. Those Dark Ones of yours are the real deal, yeah? Comrade Corbett had an eye on them for a long time. Just imagine them domesticated, then unleashed on the enemy. <laughs> Hey, 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 steady, steady, steady now. All right, all right, you're on top, D'Artagnan, you are on top. What now? Uh, you were looking for the Dark One, right? Well, he is nearby, at Oktyabrskaya. I can take you there. No tricks this time, you have my word. Everyone on the ground, now! Artyom? No! Shit, he got away. Why did you attack the storage alone? You could have tried to call me. Well, things worked out. But you'll have to get out of here on the double. I know an exit to the surface here. There's a swamp, but it's traversable. Let's go.
Put this on. That's for the gangsters. If I'm lucky, our people will be waiting for me at the outpost in the abandoned church. I will tell them everything I know about Pavel, about a test of some kind they're going to conduct, and will continue my way to Oktobraskaya. The Dark One is there. Here it is, the swamp. The base is right across in the church. You can't see it from here. There's a powered winch ferry. It needs fuel. You should be able to get some in the plane or in the cache at the gas station. Stay out of water if you want to live. Well, that's all. Good luck, Artyom.
I made quite a lot of noise pushing through the marshes. If they really are our people in the church, I will soon meet them.
Inside. Don't waste your filters. I had you sighted when you were way out there. Almost shot you, too. <laughs> that would teach you to answer radio hails. But I, well, I felt it was you. I hope you'll forgive me for the gardens. For some reason, I was genuinely glad to see Anna, my pain in the ass partner. She finally stopped those wicked jokes of hers. Looks like she's ashamed of having left her partner at the battlefield.
I didn't take you seriously before. But Hunter, he read you right from the start. He put his trust in you. It took me time. I didn't understand until I saw you in action, and I almost got you killed. <laughs> you don't make this easy for me, Artyom. I'll stop for now. Go on and get ready. The guys are coming soon and we're all going to Aktiabriskaya. By the way, a traveling gun merchant stopped here for the night, so you could take a look at his merchandise. That's a great idea, girly. Help an old man survive these trouble times. Buy some so, guns. So, what's going on? Stalker team is on the move. Should be here within the hour. Great. These are handmade, but are still good enough. Tanya. What's so in the air? A Cal great caliber to use against situation. mutants. It's incredible. For ten years, nothing. These but knives static. are perfect, then made of spring month, steel. I got Saint Petersburg. The incendiary is so dangerous, but they sure do burn stuff well. If you need ammo or anything else, come again. Ah, that's old news. What do you hear from New York and London, huh? <laughs> I don't know about London, but there's this city up north. Porania Zori. There's a nuclear power plant. Some people survived there. I talked to them. Barbarians were laying siege on them, but they still held the fort. You're a great liar, Sanya. <laughs> you could write plays about miserable life. Back them into the Bolshoi. Have you ever been to the catacombs? Only once. Really old church catacombs. No idea how old they could be. They even survived the nuclear bombs. Some people from the church hid here during the war, but... They just... They just disappeared. Could have gone to the main metro tunnels, or... Well... People say things, you know? You mean the big mama? Who might that be? Well, our guys are fast. Check it out. Just in case. That's what Rod Block! That's an old one. I know that voice. Shit. I can't place it. Wait a minute. Could it be Lesnitsky? Traitor. I never served you in the first place. We'll take this one back. No! That's it. Move!
All the roads lead to Octavraskaya. The Dark One is there. Anna is there now too. In the hands of my enemies. The hands of the traitor. Lesnitsky. So, who is this girl again? A hostage. We'll use her for negotiating with the Order. Just make sure she wears a gas mask. If she's infected, she's dead. And of no use to us. So, what do we do with her? Log her up and keep an eye on her. Anything happens, it's your head. I'll come get her when we're done here. feverish. die soon anyway. We're here to make sure he does. Finish him! <laughs> Guys! No fit! Hey, you! It's closer! Come closer! I'm done for. So... So listen. The Reds. They knew of the infection. They came on the second day. No one had died yet, but they came with the flamers. How else could they have known? Go, tell everyone, tell it, it was the Reds.
We're short of people for the unloading operation, so go and get those two on the double. They have to be at the storage in two minutes. Go! Yes, sir. Hey, what the... Asshole. Well, it was just my imagination after all. Hey you, firing squad. Time to get back to work, eh? Hey, come on, what's taking you so long? If you don't get to storage, Comrade Svolich will have your ass. Damn. I wish they'd relieve me soon. I'm so tired of this. So, what do they have of you? Hmm. Steel helmets, six pieces. Gas masks, 17 pieces. <laughs> huh. These will surely come. Filters, 22 pieces, short of again, short of everything, ammo, filters, shit. So what he's got in his pockets? No bullets? Sure love to hit the ah, sack shit. now. Hold 
cool like Gone to sleep or what? Damn. Hey! Looks like there's. <clears throat> well, it was just my imagination after all. Hey, wh what the hell was that? <sighs> no, it's not so bad, actually. Apart from the brass, smoke could turn this place into hell. Sleep deprivation does play its tricks. Oh, damn! Is that a nail in my boot or what? Not much, Comrade Major. What? You can't break one flimsy door? Come on! Here! Begin! Shit. Sleep deprivation 
Comrade Lesnitsky, the operation is progressing as planned. We'll be quickest within an hour. Well, the experiment has been successful. We need to report that to General Corbett. Will you go? Yes, sir. Rigor mortis isn't really setting in. Skin hemorrhages, bleeding, standard clinical.
They have no masks. We need two masks here, now! The pieces of the puzzle are falling together. And the big picture is horrifying and unbelievable. I will tell the others about this. But I still can't make myself believe it. The Reds have infected Oktyabraskaya. A peaceful station denizens of which never suspected anything. With an unknown deadly virus. And then their mop-up squads entered it under the pretense of saving the station from the epidemic. And eliminated everyone they could. Women, children, old people. To prevent the infection from spreading. And if all this is true, then me and Anna could be infected too. We've been saved from being killed, but we don't know if we're going to survive for long. I have a feeling that everything will end soon. We won't survive this war, Artyom. No one will. I feel alone again, like when I was a girl and father was away on a mission. Nothing around me, empty and cold, as if I were just a spark from the fire flying away and then gone. It's hard for me to tell you these things, Artyom, but I want to feel that I'm alive. Touch me. Well, there seems to be nothing wrong with you. Congratulations, youngsters. You, Archeum, may go. While you, Anna, you have to stay some more. We need to finish treating your wound. Oh, thank God. Well, what are you waiting for? Go! Go, Artyom. I'll find you as soon as they finish patching me up. Go, Artyom. I have no medical necessity to keep you here, and I have a lot of work to do. Really, Artyom, you should go. I won't stay here for too long. Run along now. They're gonna change my bandages soon, and if you stick around, I'll have to play the good girl again. Let me swear at them for once. Come here, darling. Don't look there. What's that, Papa? Nothing. It's all right. Just don't look. When are we going to go home? Soon. Very soon. <coughs> Where's Mommy? <coughs> Where did they take her? Mama's home already. <coughs> we'll be with her soon. <laughs> I miss her. <coughs> I want to go see her now. <coughs> you will. <coughs> but, but in just a little bit. I don't believe this. There were at least two more packs left. How, listen, how much do you think we can use up in one day? Not this much. There's almost no new patients. Is it the old Who's ones that need that? Can we see the and face? how many live to become old ones? Well, less and less of them are dying. So perhaps it's come to an end. As it looks like eight books. <laughs> yes, it's eight. Simetsky, Yuri. Hey! 
Anybody? Somebody? Hey! You're not going to get away with this. I'm completely healthy. You know, like me, healthy with a good corner. Don't stand here, it's dangerous. Hey! You could take him away at least. Are you trying to infect me or what? Huh? Hey! Why? God, why? Sasha? So? Hush. What do I do now? What do I do, Doctor? Well, you know the prospect as well as I. Here. I know. Killers. I know, no, but still. You were instructed hey. on the safety precautions. Anybody? On the gloves, Help. on the mask. You signed the papers. Yes, I, I did. But the kids, how was I supposed to talk to them with the mask on? They were scared. They were crying. Yes, but you didn't save them, and you doomed yourself. We're short on people as it is, Priturak. You could have helped so many. Yes. Yes, I, I could. All right. We'll start the symptomatic treatment and see where it takes us. A mild form has cropped up lately. There are even some cases of recovery. Let's be optimistic. So, I don't have to remind you about the gloves and the mask. Yes, I know that. Perfect. Now, you take the temperature every hour. Blood samples every three hours. Call me at once, should any parameters deviate from the pattern. Of course. You see, there has only been two cases with good prospects so far. We must study them carefully. Yes, I understand. Great. They've been told to handle their stuff, and yet look at all this shit. Well, what's there to do? They got off easy, but we've got to tackle them. Yeah, and hey, what's the point? Huh? Should just burn it with the corpses and be done with it. They say it's to find the source of infection. So, are you able to isolate this thing? Yes, and no. no. Yes, and no. Okay. Looks like it, but let's check the facts. What do we know? It's trying to call your base. It shows you successes. It's basically not very simple. You can't go in there. It's a high danger zone. Doctor, you know I'm no man. Please explain. Uh, I'm sorry, Carol. Here are the facts. In the first two days, the mortality rate was around 95%. In the third, it dropped to about 25%. Today, we only have two new infected. And they have a light infection, prospects of recovery looking promising. Now, as you understand, Moscow never was a natural habitat for this virus. And in its wild form, it remains dangerous much longer. So, what does all this mean? It is not a regular virus. It's a weapons-grade strain, engineered to achieve maximum lethality within a short time, and then turn harmless. Damnation. Where did it come from? I have heard of a new generation of bioweapons based on this virus, being developed before the war. But where did it surface from now, after all these years? Bioweapons? My god. Just in case, I have some Rangers questions. One of them could have brought this surprise from the past to the Metro. Only but I feel perfect! Ah, that's great. I'm really happy for you. You'll just stay here for a day, your cold gets better, and we'll let you go back to the Alps. And why would I <coughs> sit here because of a simple cold? We're going to make sure it's just a call, and you're free to go. But I've had this cold for a long time. Other than that, I feel great. Oh, that's just perfect. Means we've nothing to fear. Means that the day after tomorrow, you can go back. Why not now? Well, it's the rules, you know. You also know what happens to those who break rules here, don't you? I 
do? What the hell? Just listen to me. My kisses are dropping out. Stay here. Perhaps that could help them. 
Quarantine is no fun of games, as you understand. There have been some casualties. The medics are doing their best. Well, let's hope this is enough. And here, what should we do? Let's hope. And you should work just as usual. And take the rumors with a grain of salt. Thank you. I see. Quarantine oh, is no fun of games. George, Bosman. You go this way. Sorry, that's forbidden without the permit. That's our man. Leave this one through. He got a permit. Filters and ammo, Artyom. We probably won't have such a chance anytime soon. Well, we sure got lucky the Rangers were here. Why did they fight anyway? What do they care for us or the refugees? That's what puzzles me. Where's the profit? Nobody signed any contracts with them. We didn't even promise anything. What were they thinking? Nothing. It's their job. The Polish Rangers were doing stuff like this from the very beginning. What? Fighting the Reds? Nah, if there's an epidemic, dangerous mutants, anything, then Polish sends the Spartans to handle the situation. And what's up now? They came because of the epidemic, but we already set up the quarantine and the Reds cleared out the source. So they helped us out so that the Reds don't get too enthusiastic. And what's the profit Polish is making here? They're far from here. The epidemic wouldn't reach them. The states had been arranged long ago. Police handle stuff like this, and nobody touches them. They're neutral. They also handle negotiations if there's a war or shit like that. Ah, I get it now. I see. Don't start a war, but benefit from the results. Yes, that's good business. Sure, but we're not doing commerce to make a loss either. Come here, Ranger. Let's haggle. You can buy it without the second thought. You won't find cheaper. Just buy these. They'll prove a great investment. Hey, some throwing them. Cheap. Good luck with your trade. Come here, Ranger. I got great weapons. Good luck with business, Ranger. Come on, take a look. I bet you don't have this in Sparta. Artyom, take note of the funds Hanser expends on this quality. And they are generally Detention quite the reserved with their money. Opening the airlock. Perhaps they are aiming for an additional trump card to use in negotiations at Polis. Good luck in the tunnels, Ranger! In some other time and place, what happened could be life-changing. But there is no time but present, and no place but the metro for us. And we must do everything we can to save it. I have to hurry and catch up with the Dark One. Anna has to tell her father of what Korbut and Moskvin are doing. Anything else is a luxury we can't afford right now. We've got that door! Open up! 
soon the leaders of Hansa, Redline, and Reich will meet in Polis, hoping to reach a peaceful settlement on D6. But I know the nature of man all too well, Artyom. War is as certain as the fall of night, unless a miracle happens. Come through! Well, we won't catch the train with the Dark One moving along the tunnel. But there is another way. We're leaving the station. Here's our pass. All right. Are you going to Polis? No. Open the Interline Tunnel for me. But the Interline is a dead end, and very dangerous. A dead end? No way. That's our road to Polis. Open up. Let's go, Artyom. Come on! I can't keep it open forever! Careful with the As generator! As you see, it's no dead end. That's just what the Hanser authorities claim to discourage people from entering these passages. An unprepared man could easily lose his way here. Or even become lost within himself. But as long as you're with me, there is no danger. Most people believe Metro to be just tunnels and stations, a lifeless and soulless conglomerate created by human hands alone. There's a special place in the Metro. The few people who come upon it never return. I call it the River of Fate because it can change your destiny, wash away the silt of the past, and offer the chance for a different future. and time where that chance is granted. Remember, we must find the Dark One. It is the only thing we are to ask of the river. The Metro is a living, breathing thing, with a heartbeat, a soul, and a mind. It's an abandoned place.
Черда это? Some monsters, nothing else. Let's go. There's something behind these cobwebs. Is that a sign? The grate is rusted and poorly attached. Give me a hand here, Artyom. One, two... Ah. Continue burning it, Artyom. Look, water. We're almost there. Pretty close. Darkness envelops us. We must not get lost in it. Do not rush. And don't be surprised by anything. It is a strange place. You can pick it up. I think it's for you. for long.
This is it. The river of fake. Not so impressive, perhaps, on the surface. Familiar scenery? It's the tower. And down there is the city of the Dark Ones. It's the moment he launched the missiles. Look, that's her. The river will cleanse you, forgive your sins. You can change your fate. You can do it. Choose your destiny and be free. to lose him. Nobody. A dead end. Is this where you almost caught him? You must try again, Artyo. The Dark One is still at that freak show on the train. The river almost got me this time. 
Oh, it's working again. We're back in the desert of the river. When we got out of the river, the dark one was very close. He can't have gotten too far ahead. Train's got to be nearby. Post 13, post 13, come in. High alert, I repeat, high alert. Red saboteur sighting confirmed. Your position might be attacked. The evac train is considered their primary target. High alert! Come on, hop in. We need that miracle now, Artyom. Remember everything I told you about the Dark One. You must save him! And then he just might save us all! I never believed him. And that is no surprise. But Khan's words were true. This strange river took me to the past. The moment where I sent out the signal and destroyed all the Dark Ones. And then it dropped me off at the place where I can find the last survivor of that race. A helpless and harmless child. Khan called him the last angel. The train's somewhere around here! I have this feeling!
Мам, мама, мама. Артём, Дарлин, you're so big now. Мам, I'm scared. Don't be afraid. There is nothing to be afraid of now. Don't leave, mom. I'm all alone now. You're not alone. You're the first. We remembered you and were waiting. We could remember all the thoughts of our race. And you killed everyone. And now I'm alone. I could not kill him. And while I am alive and my heart is beating, I will protect him. Khan says we will be able to use him to stop the war. Yes, he can make miracles happen, but I don't want to use him. His war was over when I targeted the missiles at his home, his family. Thank you. 
Many hungry ones here. Think your food. You all wear clothes. I want to. Like you.
houses. So high. You made the city? So huge. Why are your people down there now? Why so few? You humans killed. All your people. Strange. Foolish. Whatever my intentions concerning him might be, the little dark one just does not seem to care. He keeps following me, as if I never was going after him. As if we were tied together by fate. Time we go. You do not see them? You cannot see? Red. Dangerous. Many of them.
Sometimes I see a door. Somebody calls for you from there. Why? We are coming to Polis. Together. Come what may. The little one did not want to leave. Something is holding him. I don't yet get what. Nevertheless, I'm glad it is, because he is helpful. Afraid of being attacked, but not evil. your identification and not fucking around shit it's all right people stand up he's a police ranger going down the ring well hurry up then they're all jumpy didn't even want to let us through i'm going to rest here for a while you can do some trading if you want If 
you see Mila, tell him Pewter said hi. You'll know. Come here. Let me exchange some ammo for you. Look, buy anything you want. All the ammo is the best quality. I shoot it myself, but a man's gotta eat. These are good bullets, very good. These are the best for mutants. These you can find only here. This is your chance. Don't look at the cases. Look at how these riddle the targets with holes. Look here. Just tell me what you want. I've got it all. These knives are really sharp. The best around. Buy some. The incendiaries are great for roasting the mutants. I got the throwing knives. Very good. Come back soon. Understand I'm not unpacking all of my stuff. Just the best. Do you hear that here on the sky looks right out? Some kind of plague. Shit. It's one station to another. if we don't find him. Lieutenant, may I ask, what are we looking for here? We're not looking. We're here to cut Sansa off. Intercept supplies, break lines of communication. As if there were any around. What do you mean? There are more rats than caravans. Nobody here! Just our luck. Stuck in the middle of nowhere while a war starting. Yeah, I read a thread.
level over there. Look at the commander the light Come down, Jack. He's alone. Why can't I stop shaking? It's one man, damn it. He's alone. Well, wait till I get him. I saw you have these. Good? Now I know what for. I'll bring more. I heal. I help. Not always enough strength alone. Kulagin, take meeting and follow the path. We might still catch up with the caravan. Klimitsky, stay here. Yes, Comrade Lieutenant. Yes, sir. There is no catching them. They're long gone. Mm -hmm. We should try. Mm -hmm. Why? It's only one caravan. Because we have orders. Now move out. I still don't think we'll catch up. Thank <laughs> you. 
does play its tricks. in the open. Hide your ass now! Yes, sir! Do I have to guide you ladies by the fucking hand? Tell me your orders! We're to infiltrate the depot and wait for a ranger with a, a beast to appear. Uh, then we kill the ranger and capture the beast. Well, you do remember. But where is your step? Huh? You think the ranger's gonna give you a hug when he sees you? That the beast will roll over for tummy rub? No, sir! Screw up again and you'll be cleaning my boots the same way you kiss your mother. With your fucking tongue. You got that pizza? Sir, yes, sir. More people. No of us. Very red. Very eager to kill. Polis found a huge supply store. If anyone else captures them, we're done for. Why? So what? Stores? Because there is enough for the whole metro. Ammo, armor, guns, medicine. Maybe something worse. Then we're here to keep Hansa from getting to it? Right. <laughs> we're also here to kill them. So keep your trigger finger on that kalash.
Them again, black and red. They fear and still want to kill you. know him, and he knows you.
Mikhail Snitsky. Everything all right here? Of course. Nothing ever happens in D6. Makes you wonder why we have to stand guard. Looks like something important. All right, position taken. Perfect, Lesnitsky. Now it is your turn, Comrade Morozov. We must field test this virus that we have obtained at such risk. I think you had some uh, associates suitable for the task? Yes, Cheslav Andreevich, out of Venice. His bandits think I'm one of them, and if we pay them... Spare me the details. I just need results. Is your task clear, Comrade Lesnitsky? Yes, Comrade General. Did you think we'd just let you go? We'll see about that. I have a trump card. You. See to it then. And you will have to handle Red Square, Pavel. It's the most critical part, and there's no one else I can trust with it. Do not let me down. I won't, Comrade General. Interesting. But I'm too tired. Need to stop. He is very bad. But you're right. Killing is worse. He who sows the wind shall reap the storm. The Dark One opened up Lesnitsky's thoughts to me. I know all their plans. I know Pavel is going to be at the Red Square. And that's where I have to face him, before going to Polis. A peace conference is being held there. <laughs> Laughable. The war has already started. It won't stop while there's a person alive in Metro. All trying to stop it could just as well try and stop a tornado with their bare hands. But I still have to try. I have to reach Polis to denounce the liars. And face the storm. Shadows here. Money. Don't see me. Don't hear. Alive and dead at once. Very strange. That's them. You'll need this.
Everything else seems normal. Just the dead and silent houses all around. Today we heard the sounds in the distance. Like a roar or a crash. The silence is gone. My ears are still ringing. But death. I fear it is still close. This will be my final entry. Our fate is gone. We're no longer safe here. You won't be either. We brought this on our world. If we hear the noise, you must run and save yourself.
Strange. Can't see well with eyes. I see shadows better.
Houses around here are in good condition, but overall it doesn't look promising. I can feel something watching from the shadows. Must be the rats in the walls. Still can't shake that feeling. When I close my eyes, I almost see them. The dead linger here. They won't move on. If no one ever hears this, it doesn't matter. There's no running. They're waiting for you. I think I'll be there as well. Oh, God. Watch out. He does not understand that he's dead. He's still waiting for his mother. But she is not coming. Mine neither. Because you people killed them all.
know only one way into Polis from here. Through the Red Square. The Order keeps an outpost in the St. Basil's Cathedral. I'll get in touch with our men and tell them all I know. And my goal would be just a step away from there. It will all be over soon. There's danger here. Not like before. I feel it. And we'll be with you. We'll tell you what to do.
Don't stand. I will help. Do not disturb them, Artyom. Stay close to me. They've been here for so long. Lots of them. But they are all lonely. Only fear and pain. They can't leave. And want somebody to stay with them. There are bad people. Many. Very red. Opa! One more! Put your weapon on the ground and hands behind your head! I will need a leader, you are? Well, you're not yet to run out someday. You can disregard the order about the weapon, okay? Comrade, your special orders directly from Comrade Corpus from Central Israeli Radio. We are in the
And you have a chance. You know you could have stayed at the red line. We would have taken you in. He still knows how to shoot, huh? You just had to escape, huh? And then come right here. You'd use your fucking head sometimes, that's all. Or what? Maybe you thought Corbus forgot all about you? Not on your lifetime, but on your... And neither did I. You didn't like it our way, didn't want to join us, huh? So you'll just have to buy the fucking dust here. Octavriskaya was successful. The virus kills fast and goes inert fast. If we can get enough of it, blaming at the whole metro is possible. But we must capture D6 first. Thus, Comrade Morozov, you have only one chance to pull this off. The Order has good fighters, but there are too few of them to cover all the entry points. Our scouts have located a poorly descended entrance through Kremlin. While Miller's at the peace conference in Polis, he will be unable to command his men. That's when we strike. Yes, a week longer, and then comes the dawn of a new age.
We have to make it to Polis in time for the peace conference. There isn't going to be any peace. Just war. The last war. Now I know the answers to all the questions. Pavel's head proved to be a real treasury of Corbett's sinister plans. Something strange here. Wait. to see.
Thank God, you're in one piece, and you've brought a friend. Wait, is this? Artyom, this kid shouldn't be out there without a gas mask. What the fuck? Ah, so it is, so it is. A child of the surface, a dark one. No, don't shoot him, Miller. Then get it away from me. No mask, I should have known. This one's green, but that one's yellow. Tell him I'm not a danger. Seems he is adapting well. Yes, that will keep him alive. May I talk to him, Artyom? Colonel Miller, put your fear aside. This child is the future. You need only take its hand. My hands are full enough. I doubt this creature can help us. But you too. Go on without me. 
before I give in to better judgment and rid the Earth of it. How is this? Oh, oh, I, I can understand his thoughts. And I can hear yours, Artyom. Can you hear anyone's thought just by touching them? With Artyom, it's different. We can talk from afar. He was adopted long ago. What do you see, Artyom? The Dark Ones changed you so that they could understand us. What's behind that door? Did you hear? They call you. I can hear. Open this. Wait. That looks like one of the sealed doors in D6. Yes, an exhibition. It has a strong lock, too. We've yet to break it. What's there? My people? They're inside. Sleeping. Incredible. Look at this. They're hibernating. He is not alone. I must wake them up. It's time for them to leave. We are all going there now. We'll open the door if we can. There's... death... nearby... all around. But I must wake them, or be alone forever. Now listen. Help us, and we'll help you. I will. What needs to be done? I must wake them. We'll have to improvise. Hey, hey! Wake, wake up, up, you bastards! Colonel, can you open the gate where the gardens line ends at D6? Do you have the code? I have all the codes for D6, but I can't promise a thing. You'll have to. He will help us in police if you do. Take him along then, and brief me on the way. If I'm convinced that he'll help us, I'll open your door. Follow me. He is not alone. He's not the last. I understand his excitement and his wish to immediately meet the others, to free them and wake them up. But he has agreed to wait a bit longer. First he's going to try and help us. If we make it to the conference, the Dark One will be able to open up the thoughts of Moskvin, or Corbut himself. Perhaps make them stop this madness. This is our last chance. Artyom, we already knew of Oktobriska from Khan. And we did confront Moskvin on this. Yet he didn't even try to disprove Open it. Gate. He told them by sheer yes, luck their chemical defense squad was exercising nearby. And thus, despite some sacrifice, they were able to nip this darkling epidemic in its blood. Otherwise, it would have engulfed the whole of it. What can you say for that? Even I would have done the same. But come on, it was Lesnitsky, the, the yes, agent sir. who stole a virus container from D6 right before the outbreak. So what? There is not a single living witness besides Artyom. Who'd believe the order? We have the D6 now. What if it was us who released the virus? But the Reds tried to break through into Hans's territory. We could make Moskvin. What can we do? We are not an army. We've less than a hundred fighters. Yes, sir. yes, Moskvin did gear up for war, but after Polis suggested that we share the wealth inside D6, he might actually agree to oh, peace. Me. And we must do everything to have that agreement signed. Moskvin? What difference does he make? He's just a puppet in Corbett's hands. And while he's talking, Corbett's forces are encircling you. You'll seal this peace agreement with your blood! Oh, what? Yes, you got sir. a better idea? You brought this ape here! Open what airlock. now? Yes, We're done with this. Let's go to the council hall. Follow me. Permission to report, Colonel. Denied. Urgent dispatch to D6 Security Force Commander. Go to highest alert. Instruct Korneyev to proceed with... Well, he knows what to do. God, 
Please let this work out. to the little one. Hurrah, comrades! Let there be peace in the name of our children! You are a liar! Come, are you out of your mind? I know what I'm doing. Just believe in me. Just this one time. Who are you? Guards, take this man away. Ranger, stand down! Artyom, little one, it's your turn. Comrade Moscovin, you must support me on this. Or else, some inconvenient details might surface concerning your brother's death. I overheard one conversation between your brother and his advisor about the threat you pose and ways to eliminate it. What the hell? Threat. We're brothers. He thinks you feel bypassed, cheated. He fears you will overthrow him. <laughs> He's totally mad. Totally. I'm going to give him an earful. Words alone will not avert his assassination plans. No, you must strike first. <laughs> Maxim, brother, I'm so pleased that we finally made up. It was a fight over nothing. Let's have a drink. Sure, brother. What? It is your life. me dead. Corbett sold you out. And now, he's got me by the balls. All because of you. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry, brother. There's no forgiveness for me. But even so, Like I gave something to brother. Yes. Yes. I did. I poisoned him. And Corbett. I'm a fool. 
I thought he wanted to save me. And he just took the power. Took me by the throat. And he's storming the D6 now. And there's that virus. And if that falls into Corbett's hands, the end. You but you are the leader! They ordered him! Call oh, the troops back! You stole them at me! Buy some time to make a deal! What kind There's of... nothing more we can do here. A spineless Hurry! Man. Faster! To the platform! Damn them! I am not surrendering D6! Follow me! It will be bad for everyone if you lose? Then I will ask for their help. He is gone. He did what he could. And now he is gone to meet his kin. I can't judge him for that. The remainders of humanity are finishing each other off in their final fight. It is not his war. I hope he was able to forgive us. Me. For what we did to his brothers and sisters. His mother and father. wasn't bullshitting this time. The Red Line's advancing on three sides. My brothers in arms. I am not a man for speeches, but here it is. You are the most dedicated, most courageous soldiers in the Metro. Each of you is worth five Reds. If you simply do the job you were trained to do, we'll win this battle. Sparta! To battle! Sparta!
back here. Check your gear. Choose time. Zippers up. Get ready, people.
facility is rigged for demolition. I gave the order back in Polis. Now that we have lost D6, our only option is to destroy it. Count us in, sir. What the hell? Nobody lives forever. What the hell is this? A pleasant surprise, Colonel Miller. Or what remains of you? Artyom, it is time. And who may this be? <laughs> ah, the resourceful young man. Tell me, Artyom, savior of the metro. Where are you going? <laughs> No need for that now. died, like most of the Spartans. Miller survived and is now in charge of police guards, even though he's confined to a wheelchair. And Khan just disappeared. He once told me, what if this little dark one is the last of the angels sent to save us? The fact that the little one came back and brought his kin, maybe that was the pardon and salvation for me, for the Order, for all of us in the Metro. The last light of hope in this kingdom of darkness. It will be better for everyone if we go away, Artyom. But one day we'll come back. I'll be big then. Goodbye, my friend. The Dark Ones are gone. But I know we will meet again. Maybe... They really were sent to save us. Maybe... We did earn forgiveness. <laughs>